Greetings to all of you. My dear sisters and brothers and my dear friends, a warm welcome to all of you from your Pastor Yari. Growing in grace. How great is our God. Lord, you have been our dwelling place throughout all generations. Before the mountains were born, or you brought forth the whole world from everlasting to everlasting, you are God. Psalm 90, verses 1 to 2. In this song of Moses found in Psalm 90, he declares that God has been the dwelling place of people for all generation. A dwelling place is your home. It is where you live. The declaration is that God has been the home of humans since they have been on the earth. The Apostle Paul expounded the same eternal truth when he addressed the Athenians on Mars Hill. He said, For in him we live and move and have our being. As some of your own poets have said, we are his offerings, his offspring, sorry. Acts 17, 28. God exists as a home for people. Three tremendous thoughts to consider. One, Moses declared that God is great because he is the God of the history. Kings live and die. Generations come and go, despite the passing of time. There is no change in the relationship between God and the humans He created. He has been the home of people for all generations. Second, He is also great because He is the God of creation. Moses considered the creation story and declared before mountains where formed God was. He even goes further back in time and declared before the earth was formed, God was. Moses gradually moved back in time from the formation of the mountains to the emergence of the land and finally the creation of the earth itself, and declared before all that you see, God was. Third, finally, Moses declared God is greater because he is the God of eternity. God is greater than the universe he produced, and before it came into being, he was. He is above and beyond all of creation. He is from vanishing point in the past to the vanishing point in the future. Thus, from everlasting to everlasting, God is. The great I am is not past, present, or future. He just is. How great is our God? If home is where the heart is, have our hearts found a place of rest in our true home? And where is that? In a personal relationship with God through the blood of the Lord Jesus Christ. Pray with me. Father, I thank you for your greatness. I marvel at the wonder of your creation. Never let me take it for granted. Amen. Blessings to all of you, my dear ones. This is your Pastor Yeti. Bye.